part by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTS to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats, your game, your style. To do on their website and come join us for a fun-friendly F&M environment. everybody, it's Kevin from Klotz Productions and I'm back with another Triple Dark Ascension booster pack opening. I'm excited to do it in this format because for one it's easy for me and secondly I went back and watched a bunch of the booster pack opening videos and personally I thought this one was the most entertaining to watch. So, you know the drill. Let's go ahead and get cracking on the first pack here. We have a Stormbound Geist, a Silver Claw Griffin, a Spiteful Shadows, Executioner's Hood, Bard the Door, Gather the Town's Folk, that's a good card, especially in Sealed, A Sightless Ghoul, Fires of Undeath, A Falcon Wrath Torturer, An Avison's Collar, a hollow hinge spirit, burning oil, and then the rare is a jar of eyeballs, which isn't that great. And then our flip card is a hinterland hermit, which turns into an, a hinterland scourge. Let's go ahead and open the second pack. First pack wasn't very impressive. I got to the rares and I was like, oh wait, we've already been through the uncommons. Or the rare. I can get this open. First card is Break of Day. A Hunger of the Howl Pack. Stormbound Geist. Screeching Scab. Oh God Inquisitor. Nibblus of the Mist, a Highborn Ghoul, Saving Grasp. First uncommon is a Wolf Hunter's Quiver. I think this could be a good card if it didn't have such a high equip cost. A Curse of Thirst, Strangle Root Geist. That's a good card. It's my seventh Geist now, though. And the rare is Curse of Blood, Bloodletting. Not really familiar with that card. Have a Wolf Token. I know somebody's going to make a comment about how I pronounce Wolf. And we have a Lampholt Elder, which turns into a Silver Pelt Werewolf. And then we have a Foil which is also a rare, which is a counter lash. So yes, this pack had a foil rare in it, which means it had two rares, but counter lash isn't really that great. At least nobody's playing it, not that I know of. So here's the last pack. And for those of you that are curious, this is from FNM Winnings. That's where I get all my booster packs. So I have a favor of the woods. Forge Devil, another Bar the Door, Death's Caress, a Russet Wolves, Russet Wolves, I don't know if that's the right way to pronounce that or not, Talons of Falcon Wrath, another Gather the Townsfolk, another Falcon Wrath Torturer, and a Heavy Matic. Our uncommons are Markov Warlord. A Faith Shield, which I think is a pretty solid card. And a Chill of Foreboding. And the rare is Markov Blade Master. I think this could be a good card, but the fact that it only has one toughness it means it's really easy to kill. 
I mean, if it hits you one time, then it's a 3-3 and gets a lot bigger, but because of its one toughness, I don't think it's that great. I have a human token. And then the flip card is Chalice of Life, which turns into Chalice of Death. And I got a planes. So, that's it for this booster pack opening. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I will see you all back here for the next one.